Hello everyone and welcome to my channel, Tracy's Nail World. If you are new, welcome. If you are returning, thank you. My name is Tracy and I decorate nails, give tips, and perform nail art on real nails and acrylic nails. I also do stamping, product reviews, and nail hauls. Your nails are a way to speak your style without having to say a word. I welcome you to stay and watch, give a thumbs up, and subscribe to my channel. Thank you and happy watching. Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel. If you are new, welcome. If you're returning, thank you. My name is Tracy and I do nail art on this channel. I do stamping, I do uh, product reviews, I do nail hauls, I do all sorts of stuff that deal with um, nail designs and whatnot. Um, if this is something you're interested in, please hit that like and subscribe button. And if you could, please um, share my videos and help me to build my channel. I greatly appreciate it. I'm so grateful to all of you who are subscribed. You mean a lot to me. You've helped me come so far and I really love you guys. Thank you so much for all your support. I, it's greatly appreciated. It does mean a lot to me. Um, <clears throat> Also, I will leave all my social medias in the description box below, as well as um, this nail group that I'm involved in. It's called The Nail Life. It was created by the wonderful Jessica from Jessica's Nail Studio. You should come check us out. We do wonderful things there. We have a lot of um, activities. We do um, bingo once a month. We have Celine Ryden nail card designs and all sorts of different collabs and whatnots over there. It's, it's a lot lot of fun um it's a positive uplifting supportive group uh we support each other on our channels and our on our, all our social medias wonderful women over there really beautiful caring people um very talented women as well um there's also two moderators one is katie from katie cat's nails and deb from nails by deb i will leave all this information in the description box below you can come check us out see what we're all about um you do have to answer a couple of questions and you do have to agree to a terms um because like i said we are all about positivity no negativity whatsoever is allowed in this group no bullying no nothing like that so we wanted to create um jessica wanted to create a wonderful group so that we could um just support each other and have fun you know so yeah come check us out and um have some fun with us. So today I'm having a very small uh, Timu haul, okay, and I figured I'd share it with you. I haven't really done too much with um, <clears throat> nail products and stuff like that lately with Timu because I've been concentrating on some other stuff, but um, yeah, I figured what the heck, it's fall. I wanted to get some stickers. As you can see, there's a whole bunch of stickers here that I'm going to be using in some designs um, and everything. So yeah, so let's get started. Um, also, I did stop at the Dollar Tree and I got this beautiful plate here. Um, it's actually a marble. Let me open it up so you can all see what it looks like. Um, because uh, there's a glare on the box. But yeah, it's, it's this really beautiful marble. Now I have a couple other plates from them as well. One is an animal print and the other one is like um, an abstract print. So this is a new one that I just got. It's really cute. I like the, the marbling effect. It's really neat. So yeah, got that. Put that there. And then also on Timu... These are really cute. Um, these are actually glow in the dark. So that's the main reason why I got them because I love my glow in the dark. Anybody who, anybody who knows me <laughs> knows that I love my glow in the dark stuff. So I had to get these. Now these are really, really cute um, moons. Um, I'm trying to find a nail uh, that I can stick this on. So that I can show you what they look like. Okay, I don't know if you can see that. It's a nail. It's a, sorry, it's a moon. It has a butterfly and it has like a uh, four-pointed star on there. It's very pretty. And as you can see, there's pink. There's um, some yellow ones. Uh, there's white. 
There's blue, and there's even a black and white one here. Let me take the black and white one out, because this one is really, I like this one. This one's really pretty. Let me turn it this way so you can see. There's the butterfly and a four-point star. Very, very pretty. And like I said, they all glow in the dark. Um, I, I'll take a picture um, after the video. I'll have to take a uh, picture of them. This, I think, was maybe... Um, Oh gosh, I want to say maybe a dollar to a dollar twenty-five, something like that. I'll have to look it up. If you want, I can get you the uh, the link. Just let me know in the description, um, in the comments, and I will find that link for you. But yeah, these are really, really cute. I think they'll come in handy, especially now that it's fall and with the glow in the dark. It's really pretty. Oh, there's a pink and blue one. Let me see if I can get that one out. Because that is really nice. I like that one. I don't know if you can see it in my hand. Yeah, you can. It's blue on the top and then pink on the bottom. Really, really cute. I like the ombre. It's really nice. So, yeah. So, that is my little... Uh, my little charms. I like them. Really nice. Okay, so now here we go with the stickers. Now, I got some stickers, and I also got some um, water decals. These are stickers, and most of these were only like maybe 50 cents, 60 cents. So, yeah, this is, um, let me try to take it out of the package here. This comes with two. Two different sheets and these are really really cute i love the foxes they have some mushrooms on here some little acorns you got your pumpkins and i think these are peaches if i'm not mistaken you got some foliage down here really really cute stickers i really like it it says hello autumn super super cute and then again here you have some foxes these are really cute i like this fox it almost looks like a female, and she's really, really adorable. And look at the little acorn with the eyes. That's so cute. And there's some mushrooms. And I'm not sure what kind of a, a nut that is. I think that's actually a, a chestnut, if I'm not mistaken. And you've got some boots down here. You've got an umbrella, a sleeping fox. I thought these were really, really cute. And I thought they would be perfect for the fall. So yeah, I got these, I think, like I said, two sheets for like 50 cents, which isn't bad. It's not a bad uh, price. You can't go wrong for 50 cents. So, and then I got these. I had to get these because these glow in the dark. <laughs> and it's only the one sheet. And as you can see, you can tell what they look like. Really cute looking ghosts. So I thought that would be really neat for um, like a spooky Halloween um Manny, and I like this uh, wreath up here. Let me take it out anyway, just so I can show you the wreath on it. If it wants to work with me. <laughs> All right, there we go. Yeah, this wreath is really neat. It's got spider, um, pumpkins, it's got the skulls, and it's got a little bat over here really really cute can you see that i don't know if you can see there we go now you can see it better i think that is super super cute and like i said these glow in the dark that is one of the main reasons why i've got it i love my glow in the dark everybody knows that i love my glow in the dark um stuff and you know and the funny thing is i use glow in the dark all year round i don't just use it for the fall or the or um the Halloween season. I use it all year round because that's how much I love it. Okay, and some more glow in the dark. Now these are really cute. Like I said, I don't think I paid no more than like 50, 60 cents for all of these. So that was a really neat, um, a nice uh, thing. So these are really, really super cool. These, there's some scary skulls. You got uh, a scary ghost you've got spiders you've got the barbed wire you've got um a handprint you've got the the web you got it almost looks like the joker 
I don't know if you can see that, but there's the Joker. And then you have this skull, and it's got a snake going through it. That's just really cool. And then you have the bones, the crossbones. Okay. But yeah, I thought that was really, really cool. I hope you can see that. They're really, really neat. Another one, another nice one for, um, for Halloween. Okay, and if you need any of the links, I can look them up and I can find them for you. Um, just let me know and I will look for them for you. Okay, all right. So next we have, I think these are water decals, if I'm not mistaken. Um, yeah, I think these are water decals. Okay. And it's only the one sheet. No, they're stickers. But these are really, really cute. They're very tiny. Um, as you can see, it's a very tiny sheet. This has the Halloween sign in it. There's some ghosts. There's some little tiny babies here that are dressed up. Really, really cute. you got some jack-o'-lanterns. Here's a witch. She's so pretty. I like that. And then you got these uh, corner um, stickers. You can add on to, like, maybe the corner of your nail. You got a little boy here dressed in a top hat. You got some ghosts. You got some pumpkins. And there's even some bumblebees here. You got little bitty candies. So you got an array of everything. There's some bats up here in the corner. So you really do have an array of different um, um, things to put on as a Halloween set. Yeah, you can see the baby there now in the, um, the pumpkin outfit. So cute. Wait. There's kitty cats up here. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. That is so cute. Oh, my God. I love this. I, You know what? This season is going to be so sweet. I love I love the Halloween and the fall area. Um, not area. Sorry. The fall season is one of my favorite times of year. Okay. And we have another one here. See if I can open this up. And I have a sticker book that I put these in, so that'll work in handy. These are really super cute as well. Very tiny as well as the other one. You can see it's very tiny and it's only one sheet. You got your pumpkins, you've got a witch, you've got a scarecrow, you've got your scary cat, a bat. There's an owl over here, you've got the spooky houses. Um, you got these tombstones here, which would be a really neat, like, border. Um, I think that's super cute. Um, here, I don't know if that's a witch. It looks like a witch holding a pumpkin right there. And then, of course, you got your spooky haunted house. Super, super cute. I really like these. There's a little bat down here. Really, really cute. Okay. Hope everybody is having a good day. They're having fun. Oh, wait. I forgot to see. I seen this just now. Here's a black border with some cobwebs on it. Really cool. You can, like, make it into, like, a whole um, scenery across all your nails. So that'll be cool. Yeah, I hope everybody's having a great day. They're having um, some fun. Um... Sorry, I just had a train. Uh, my brain went somewhere else. Sorry about that. <laughs> but yeah, I hope everybody's doing well and they're having a great day. So, um, let me get a white background so you can see these. These are more of a cutesy kind of pinky thing. I don't, I'm not too big on the pinky kind of colors. But I think the main reason why I got them is because of these glow-in-the-dark fingers. Which is really cool. And then you got your axes. You got your um, haunted house. You got your spooky tree. You got a skeleton hands here. You got the scream ghost, I think that is. The scream. I never watched any of the scream movies. Don't come at me. I just, it's just not my cup of tea. So, <laughs> but yeah, that is really cute. Like I said, I'm not a pinky kind of girl kind of thing. You know, so, but it was cute. I figured, what the heck, why not? Okay. Put that back in there. So, yeah, I'm going to have a lot of fun with these stickers. It's going to be so much fun. 
Okay, so next we have, these are like, um, almost like a 3D kind of, um, nails, uh, stickers. All right, let me get this open. This is also one sheet. Okay. And here you can see they're raccoons. I thought they were super cute because I love, I love raccoons. I think they are the most cutest little things you could ever see. Really, really cute. And you got a lot of foliage. You've got um, pumpkins. You got a couple of umbrellas here. But yeah, those are super cute. I love, love, love raccoons. They are so stinking adorable. Really, really super cute. Because this is going to be a fun thing. Okay, so we'll put that one back. Alright, and let's go in here with these. Now, these are the water decals that I was telling you about. Um, there's 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12 different sections. Okay, so here you got um, some foliage with blues and oranges. Really pretty. Am I in? Yeah, there we go, in frame. And then here in this section, you have some woodland animals. You got a fox, a bunny, a deer, um, some bears, and then you also have some foliage. Okay, and then in this section here, it's more of the full kind of cozy. You've got scarves, you've got your uh, leaves, you've got a cup of cocoa, um, you've got some books here. Really, really cute. And then up here, it's more like the pumpkin spice kind of thing. you got your pumpkin spice coffees, your lattes, whatever. Um, I'm not a big p pumpkin spice kind of girl. I'm not into it. <laughs> I don't drink coffee, so it's not my thing. And then these are just foliage and some umbrellas and some boots. Really cute. And then down here you have, you've got teddy bears. you got a hat. you got another scarf, some booties, socks. You got some um, lamps here as well. Up here, you got more of your woodland animals. You got some more bears. You even got like a white owl here. I don't know if you can see. Okay, and then you got your acorns, and there's the cute little raccoons. You got a deer wearing a sweater, holding some um, uh, wood. Probably gonna make a fire. <laughs> really cute. And then in this one, let me open this so you can see that middle section. And what I'm going to do with these bigger ones, okay, is I will cut them. Um, I don't have a, a cutter, but I'll use my scissors to, to cut the sections out. Here you have, um, I'm thinking that's a bear and a little owl. You got some field mice, you got the chickmunks or squirrels, some more foxes, super, super cute. Says hello autumn on there. And then here you have, I think this is a, a heater, maybe a um, fireplace. You got some books, kind of like that cozy, cozy thing again. Um, you got some lattes, you got a puppy wearing a scarf. Super cute. Oh my god, no, wait. Those are owl, um, not owls, um, ghosts wearing a, a little scarf. That's so cute. Okay, and then here you got your more of your kind of more cozy kind of thing. You got your boots, you got your pumpkins, you've got a, um, this is a mushroom, but it almost looks like an animal wearing a mushroom hat. Super cute. You got your owls really cute <clears throat> excuse me and then here you have um different animals but they're wearing um they're holding um umbrellas like here's a little chickadee kind of bird you got your squirrel you got your mice holding the umbrellas you got some foliage and then you have a woodpecker right here super super cute and then more of the fall scenes with um your trees your background scenes, really pretty. 
some books with leaves on it. So yeah, that's going to be a, a really cool kind of design. This is, like I said, these are water decals, so you need to put them, like what I do is I'll get one of my stampers and I'll cut the image out, put it on my stamper, wet the, the image, and then the, the backing will come off and then I just stamp it onto the nail. <clears throat> I'll have to do a video showing you how to do that. But yeah, that is super cute. Okay, so let me put that over here. And now these... <laughs> I got these specifically for my sister because she loves cows. She is a cow freak. So I had to get these because I want to make her a set of nails. She don't usually wear nails, but... I think if I make her a cow set of nails, she will wear them. <laughs> I just think these are so stinking cute, and I had to have them. Now, this sheet, I think, was maybe $1.50, almost $2, but I think it's more because it is a cow, because I find out there's a lot of cow um, designs out there that are more on the pricier side, but it's fine. I... Like I said, I don't really use it very often, but I had to have this for my for my kid sister. Now you got your cartoon character cows. These are super cute. Now this one is more of a realistic cow. That is really like nice. And then you have your um, cow patterns. Here is almost like you could put it on like the whole nail. Okay, kind of like um, a wrap. A nail wrap and then you've got some more designs of cows here super super cute yeah a lot of cow patterns and stuff like that so I thought it would be super cute and now these you can cut as well into different sections okay this also comes with 12 different um, things so really cute my sister will love that okay so now we've got another sheet here as well I think I didn't pay no more than a dollar, maybe dollar fifty for these sheets. More water decals, more cozy kind of thing, more cutesy, um, cutesy animals and stuff like that. You got your hedgehog holding an apple. You got squirrels. You got um, this almost looks like a uh, I don't know. I can't tell if that's a puppy dog or what. But then you got your raccoons. You got some kitty cats and some mushrooms and some foliage. Down here you got owls. I'm trying to hold this. You got some owls up here. You got some foxes. You got baby deers. Some more foxes. Some more deers and some birds. Super cute. Oh my god, there's a sloth on here. Oh my god. He's so cute. And then you got your squirrels, you got a beaver, you got a iguana. Of course, the raccoons are super cute. You got the puppy wearing a like a birthday hat. You got a little bunny. Really cute. Some more raccoons, hedgehogs, foxes, some mushrooms. You got some teddy bears. You got some Oh my god, there's some cows. She's going to love that. <laughs> you got your panda bears. My niece would love that. She loves panda bears. And then you got some sheep and a couple of mushrooms in there. Now these are more of your cutesy kind of cutesy girly kind of thing. I don't do that girly kind of thing. I'm in a, I'm not a butchy girl, but I don't like the pinks and the purples and the girly kind of thing. I'm more into your your mellow tones and your like your browns and your blues and your more fall colors so yeah you got a panda bear you got some an elephant that is a cute hippo really cute you got a giraffe down here you got some uh, trees and there is another sloth and they're all holding like I don't know if it's a bubble gum or if it's cotton candy but yeah and here you got an owl a fox a rabbit another hedgehog got a little tree stump some books super cute you got some deers and owls there's a butterfly some floppy ear bunnies <laughs> some little blue hedgehogs you got your your raccoons and then you got um 
some mushrooms down here. <clears throat> Excuse me. I'll be right. Let me take a drink. Hold on one second. Sorry about that. I had a tickle in my, my throat. Now, this is more of birds. Different birds, like the love birds. You got a bird house. You got a whole bunch of birds on trees and stuff. These almost look like peacocks. Super cute. Now, these are more of your um, wild exotic animals. You got giraffes. You got the rhinos. You've got the pe uh, not peacock ostriches. You also got some um, tropical in here too. You got uh, the pine. I'm mean, sorry, not pine tree. Um, coconut tree. You pineapples. Your bananas, and then you got some. They look like donkeys, I'm going to say. Super cute. And I don't know if that is a meerkat or what that is. I'm not sure. You'll have to let me know what that one is. Super cute. And then more bunnies. And some birds. And some mushrooms. Another cute one. Now this one is my favorite. I had to get this because if anybody knows... I have cats. I have three cats and they're just, they're all brats. They're all spoiled. <laughs> I've got one Russian blue. I've got a regular, I got two regular tabbies, um, two boy, uh, two girls and one boy. And the girls, they despise the boy. They do not like him. So I have to bring him out separately and close the living room door so he can spend time out here. Yeah, they don't like him. <laughs> but this I had to have. These are so stinking cute. Now, I know one of my sisters, my nail sisters, Katie. <laughs> Katie Cat's Nails. Uh, she loves cats. She is a cat mom, just like I am. And she would love this. But there's all sorts of different little kitty cats designs. I thought this was just so stinking cute. Here you got kitty cats with some Halloween hats on. One has a piece of bread around its head. That's so cute. And then you have the uh, funny face cats. One wearing like a, um, a bandana on its head. One with glasses. Super cute. It says cat mom. Yep, that's me and Katie. <laughs> and then you just have some cutesies. And then you've got some rainbow, pastel rainbow ones. And this even has some fishies. Super cute. And then you have more. Here's one with some uh, glasses on it. Super cute. Some butterflies. You even just got the tail on here. Really cute. Here's one with a paw print above it. Really, really cute. And then you have like the picture frame kind of cats with the cameras. Really, really cute. And then these are more your lovey, lovey dovey kind of cats. Super cute as well. So yeah, I had to have this. This was adorable. I'm going to have to say my favorite are these ones. Because of the Halloween. And these ones down here as well. These two. And maybe maybe the, the pastel rainbow ones. But yeah. Those are super, super cute. And I know Katie will love this. So I'll have to get the link for her so she can get them. Now these are water decals as well. Okay, so the, that is everything of the stickers and water decals. Okay, so also, even, oh, I'm trying, I stuck. I have this plate from the Dollar Tree. Okay, but I also got some plates from Timu. Now, I didn't realize it, but I ordered two of the same one. So one of these is going to one of my nail sisters because she loves mushrooms she is totally obsessed with mushrooms so she is getting this plate you've got a whole array of different kind of mushrooms you've got a mushroom house right here this one's kind of like a um they actually have like um i don't know if they're called gypsies or what but 
These are so cute. Gypsies with the mushroom hats. All sorts of different mushrooms here. Yeah. Really, really super cute. I don't know if you can see that. But a super cute plate. I didn't have any plates with mushrooms. And we all we do sort all sorts of different um, activities in our group on Facebook. And sometimes we get the mushroom um, theme kind of thing. And I didn't have anything with mushrooms in it. So I had to get this. And I did order two. And I don't know how I made that mistake. But yes, Jessica, you're getting the second one. So... That is super cute. Now this one, um, it says Finger Angel up here, V22. I'm not sure what that means. But this is another cute stamping plate. Sorry about the background noise. I am on a main street and I can't help that. So this is kind of like a layering and it's bent. Um, yeah... I didn't see that. Okay. I'll have to try to fix that. But this is kind of like a layering um, plate. You have, it's almost like an orange. And then you have the background. Then you have the middle part you could put inside the background. You could put that inside the background. Same with this. Layering. All about fruits. Super cute. You got your... Your oranges, you got your kiwis, you got your apples, strawberries, uh, watermelon, pineapple, and grapes. Then you got some little faces here, which you could probably put inside of here. Really, really cute. So you can build your own animals, whatever faces you want to make, you can put inside those. I will be doing a video on how to use this. And then you got some regular, regular faces up here as well. Super, super cute. I thought this was really, really cute. Yeah, it's Finger Angel V22. Did I say what this was? No, I didn't. This plate was Jintin Y219. So, yeah, so that is my haul for today. Um, if there's anything that you see in here that you are interested in, maybe I can find the link for you. Um, and I can, you can just message me and I'll get it to you as soon as I can. But yeah, thank you for, um, stopping by and, um, watching my video. I greatly, greatly appreciate it. It does mean a lot that you have come back or you are first um, seeing me, it does mean a lot to me. If you don't mind, could you hit that like and subscribe button and help me to build my channel as you all are doing so well and I greatly appreciate you. So yeah, so that is my haul for today and um, once again, thank you so much and I will see you on the next one. Bye!